Royal fans are claiming that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle got booed in Germany. A video of the couple has also been circulated which shows the couple being booed. The zoomed out pic of this event shows a tiny paid for crowd that is clearly instructed to take out their phone and take pictures and videos, just like the paid crowd at the one young setup. The Sussexes arrived at the Dusseldorf Rathaus Town Hall in Germany for the Invictus Games event. Harry and Meghan were greeted by the town's mayor, Secretary of State, Moller Brigadier, Masterler, and General Lopbunthal. The latest round of public engagements have been compared to a royal tour, with red carpets and photo walkabouts. As the couple paid a flying visit to Dusseldorf, they were invited to sign an official book and enjoy a boat cruise along the Rhine, with blockades put in place along the city's roads. The event had many of the hallmarks of a royal visit, despite the couple being classed as private citizens rather than royals by German police. Royal biographer Angela Levin took to Twitter to question why Harry and Meghan were receiving the red carpet treatment. She said, Why are Harry and Meghan being treated like heads of state in Germany, and why has the red carpet been rolled out? They're now ordinary citizens and only represent themselves, something Harry wanted so badly. Countries should behave accordingly. A source told, Of course this is a private visit, but we do not want anything to go wrong or there to be any incident. We're showcasing the city. They will have their own security teams, but the police are being consulted and will be involved. We're hosts for the Invictus Games and we want everything to run very smoothly. There have been lots of consultations and plans have changed, but we're confident it will be a trouble-free visit. The timing of Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's visit to Europe, dubbed by some as an unofficial royal tour, comes during a busy week for the royal family. The Queen has accepted the resignation of Boris Johnson as Prime Minister and invited his successor Liz Truss to form a government. It's also the week the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's three children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, start their first term at Lambrook School in Berkshire. Telegraph's royal editor, Hannah Fern, has argued that their trip has a distinctly royal feel. All broadly follow the pattern set by the Queen, who chooses good causes and good people to honour with a royal visit, she said. Delivering a speech at the town hall reception, Harry said he is filled with such excitement at the thought of the next Invictus Games, having the backdrop of the River Rhine. He said, I can't wait to hear the roar of the crowds, to feel the adrenaline of the competition, and join in on the laughter and even the tears. Happy ones, of course while we get to witness lives being changed right before our eyes. Harry opened his speech with a few words of German and wiped his brow to applause as he smiled in relief, adding, that's about where it stops. He also jokingly asked the people at the small reception whether the beer in Dusseldorf was better than in Cologne, to the applause and nods of yes from those in attendance.